Welcome to my channel. Jags Rocks. Mr. Beast the smartest guy on social media platform. Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast is a YouTube star with the 42nd most subscribed channel in the world, sitting at 51.8 million subscribers. He has posted over 700 videos, and every single piece of content he uploaded in 2020 has gotten more than 10 million views. He was the fastest growing YouTube channel in the world in 2019, adding 13.5 million subscribers. Mr. Beast is growing with 1 million plus subscribers per month, 300 million plus views per month and earn more than $600,000 per month. So how does he do it? The business. Make no mistake, Mr. Beast is an online business owner. His real name is Jimmy Donaldson, and he is really good at growing his company. His year-to-year -year growth rate in 2019 was 101.5%, more than any other channel on the platform. The number one thing that differentiates Mr. Beast business from the others is how he runs it. It is also the core of what made him go viral. He has been credited with pioneering a genre of YouTube videos following his explosion on the platform. What is this about? Expensive stunt videos and content centered on philanthropy. Donaldson gives away money at an impressive rate, and he makes sure to get it on video every time. Once he is done with one video, he does it again, and he does it a lot. That is the genius of his channel. He found the sweet spot between reinvesting profits in business and driving even more brand awareness by making those investments entertaining to watch, going broke. People love watching people spend money. It is a world most of us don't have access to. Some people are big spenders and buy more stuff than they can afford, live above their means. Donaldson basically did the same at the beginning of his channel. In the first stage, he didn't have any money, so he found crazy challenge ideas that didn't cost anything, and filmed himself doing it. As you can see, these went viral, and brought in tens of millions of views. That is when he started making money. That also when brands started to approach him for partnerships. His first main partnership was with a brand called Quid, and they were basically paying $10,000 for any video he wanted to make, to give to anyone he wanted. From homeless people to streamers, to his parents, friends, and more, that is the basic business model. Make viral content spending a lot of money. Make a lot of money from the content. Attract sponsors for more money. Reinvest sponsors plus YouTube money. Make more content spending money. Jimmy went on to make videos of him buying everything in a Walmart, giving away houses, Lamborghinis, paying for people expensive groceries, and donating huge amounts of money to charity. It is an extremely simple and efficient business model. And he took it to exponential heights. In one video, Jimmy gives away $1 million to the winner of a contest. Cold, hard cash, make short and snappy titles that spark interest. He gets straight to the point of video from the get to go. Usually in the first 10 or 20 second of his videos he explains exactly what is going to happen in the video, this is commonly called a hook and it ensures that viewers know what to expect from to start, so they are more likely to stick around. This quite literally hooks their attention. Here is an example from one of his videos. We bought every single item in 5 stores. Starting with this one. All right. Investing in creativity. Donaldson just thinks of outrageous ways to spend money, and gets views from it because again, people like to watch other people spend insane amounts of money. Whether people get entertained, outraged, or both, they generate a lot of income for Donaldson business. If he does not stop constantly expanding based on his business model, though, he might enter a phase of unhealthy growth, exactly like companies that go bust. He does not invest primarily in gear or in new creative processes. He gives away the money in a way that has not been done before and documents it. Business mistakes. Of course, business growth also comes with its fair share of trial and error. Donaldson has recently uploaded a video where he shares footage that didn't make it to the public. One of these videos cost $90,000 to make and went to the trash. 
that $90,000 out the window, and again, many people might find this an outrageous amount of money to waste. It is a matter of scale, and of which system is in place. When Mr. Beast wastes $90,000 it seems huge at the individual level, but it a drop in the ocean at a macroeconomic level. Trial and error is part of the creative process, but it will have more or fewer consequences depending on the size of your brand. Rounding it off, Mr. Beast is an interesting case study. But you don't have to follow his strategy at all. You don't have to invest all your profits back into your business. There are more ways to grow business in a healthier way, without always being on the brink of bankruptcy. It is also important to reward yourself as a successful content creator once in a while. Keeping your integrity should also be at the top of your priority list. Don't do it for the money, do it because you get excited about it, because it is what you want to do for a living. What matters is to do what you love. This is what Donaldson has to say about why he does what he does. Find your reason and go with that. When it comes to building an audience and nurturing it, consistency is key. It comes before everything else. You can nurture an existing audience and go for natural growth by staying in touch with your people as much as possible. The more you interact with your audience and put content out there, the faster you will grow. You don't need big budgets. So go out there and do your own thing. Whatever it is you are doing, be proud of being a content creator, of doing what you love. Know that as long as you put on the work, good things will happen. Never stop creating. Thanks for watching my video.